most women choose the same guy, but in a different body. It's growing back, baby. It's growing back. As you can clearly see, it's growing back. It's growing back, baby. We back. We back. We back. We back again with another one. We back again with another banger. We back again. You know what I'm saying? I know it's been a few days, you know what I'm saying? But we back. I'm coming with a I'm coming with the visuals. Make sure you like the video, share the video, and you comment and subscribe for your boy. Hey, we're trying to make a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. And the only way we're gonna do that is if you like the video, guess what? It's free. If you share the video, guess what? It's free. If you subscribe to the channel, guess what? It's free. If you comment, guess what? It's free, you know what I'm saying? Support, 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 you know what I'm saying? Cause like I said, I always say, I know I'm great. I know that you great. So let's be great together and build a whole different type of greatness. It is. Hey, so I come across some videos, you know, every now and then. And if y'all see some videos that y'all would like me to react to or some colognes y'all would want me to react to or even go by and we'll react to, hey, let me know in the comment section down below. You know what I'm saying? I think I could bring a different type of perspective. You know what I'm saying? But you never know. You feel me? But we got another video. Um... I ain't going to talk too much about it. We just going to get right into the video. You know what? <clears throat> y'all women don't want no good man. No, y'all don't. Y'all want the thugs. Yeah, y'all want the guys that's going to break y'all heart. Yeah, you do. You keep on talking to the same type of dudes. Yes, you do. Be quiet. You do. Mm -hmm. You don't want the good guys, the simps. The guys that stay in the house and won't cheat on you. You don't want him. He's too boring. Right? He's too lame. He's not attractive. Girl, uh, you better enjoy that peace that comes with that man. That man offers peace that you ain't never had in your entire life. You hear me? You better, get, you better get with that man because of what he can do for your soul. You better get with that man for what he can do for your soul. Not for what he can do. Oh, he, he, he look good out here. Oh, he fine. Oh, baby, that don't mean anything. The older you get, you want peace and stability and love. That's it. That's all you should ever want from a man. Stop saying y'all want a good man when you ain't even attracted to what a really good man offers you, okay? You know what I like to call that? <laughs> Facts. You feel me? But I will say this. I'm going to keep this video short and simple and sweet. A lot of women say guys ain't this and guys ain't that. But the reason that is, most women choose the same guy, but in a different body. So if you don't change your style of guy up, you're going to come out with the same outcome and you're going to start saying, well, men ain't this and men ain't that. But you're choosing the same guy over and over again, just in a different body. And let me ask you another question. Are you putting yourself in the right spaces and places to meet guys that are are not like you, like what you like what you are used to? I guarantee not. You mean the same type of guy in the same type of environment, just different locations and different people. They got that same. It's like the same little quartz. You know what I'm saying? And you, you know, most 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 women or, or people in general. O overlook the red flags that come with certain people because it's like she say this person looks good you know what i'm saying or he you know he does he got he has this well my point of it is at some point if the person is not good for you you have to move on and find a different energy you know what i'm saying and like once again a lot of females don't want that guy that's just just chilling in his own lane, you know what I'm saying? Not saying he lame, but he not he not he don't have that toxicity. Or he don't have that street demeanor or that rough demeanor. You know what I'm saying? 
They 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 want they want that. And a lot of women these days, we got you know what I'm saying? They want a fast money guy. I did a video, I have not put that up. You know what I'm saying? About it was probably about a female somehow. She didn't want a banker, she didn't want no, she wanted a scammer or something like that. And it was like, are you kidding me? Because you even talking about what a person can do for me. I'm going to keep saying this over and over again. You're a grown person. You should never want somebody to take care of you. I don't understand this mindset. But that's just me. You know what I'm saying? I just ask that women, because I hear it a lot. Men ain't this, and they ain't that. Because if you take your choosing the same guy over and over and over again. Don't matter if he's light skinned, dark skinned, white, Asian, uh, black, uh, 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 Spanish. It don't matter. You're choosing the same guy, just, just in a different body. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter if you change races. You know what I'm saying? If you continue to choose the same type of guy, you can say, well, it's not the same type of guy because he's a different race. No, no, no. It's the quirks. It's the little things that make that person the same type of person. So until you understand that, you won't find the right guy. And sometimes you got to take a chance to go outside what you usually, you know what I'm saying? Because like I say, most women got this long list of, uh, uh, this is what I want a guy to be or need to be or he has to hit these marks or whatever. Knowing that the same mark that you're asking for him to be is what the last guy had. So why would you? Why would you want the new guy to meet the same marks as the last guy? It didn't work. There's a reason why it didn't work. It's a reason. And I say a lot of women are very superficial. They worried about what their friends going to think. They worried about what their family going to think. You got to, listen, you can't be living for somebody else and how they want you to live. You got to live for you. And if you're going to live for somebody else and what their opinion is of you and your lifestyle and how you, you know what I'm saying? Then you, you will never meet the person you want to meet in life. Or you need to meet, not want to meet. You need to meet a need in your life. You know what I'm saying? But that's just my opinion. And my opinion, you know, it's, 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 it's you know, it is what it is. But I want women to stop thinking that they need a finished product. Every dude that you meet in your life is not going to be a finished product. Sometimes you got to go off potential. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to tell you, most dudes that are finished products, they, and, 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 and let's say, they're usually between, let's say, 33 and up and nine times out of ten they're finished products they really not taking you serious a few there might be a few that take you but they're not taking you serious because why would I and, and, and you know I'm gonna tell you straight up a lot of dudes are opening their minds up and saying that marriage is a scam a lot of dudes are opening their mind up and saying that marriage is a scam and everybody want to be married but most people a lot, I would think a lot of people want to be married. But I'm just saying, a lot of dudes are opening their mind up and saying marriage is a scam. Right? I got to sign this paper. Let's just say I'm taking you, you taking care of you, and you never get a job. Matter of fact, I got, I got, somebody, I got somebody I know, right? They were telling me about they was married for 15 years. The, the person she was, the person, he, the person he was with, right? When they, when they got the divorce, Right? Um, it took like two years to get. But the lady, she was they was when they first got together, she was she was she was working and all. Right? And once she got pregnant, she stopped working. Right? So let's fast forward that, right? So she never worked boom 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 boom. So when they got a divorce, I don't I didn't go into detail and deep of why they got the divorce. But after 15 years of marriage, her sitting on her behind, not doing nothing, chilling, right? They get the divorce. He had to pay 34 months of, uh, of, of spousal support. And he has to pay child support. Then ask the numbers on that. And he has to pay child support, right? 
And when he retires, she gets fifty. She gets fifty percent of his retirement. In my mind, why would I get married if I know I'm gonna have to give up all of this? If if a divorce is 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 is, is possible, right? I'd rather you be a <laughs> a lifetime partner without marriage, right? But that's just my personal opinion. Make sure you like the video, share the video, comment on what you think overall. You know what I'm saying? And subscribe. Because like I said, all of those options, liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing, they're all free. So help me. You feel me?